Okay, you can train with the U.S. Olympic team. The Greco-Roman wrestling team is hosting a workshop coming up this Saturday. <laughs> wait, wait, say it how you practiced in the break. Well, I got my tongue tied and I said the, the what did Groman? I say, the Reco groman Reco groman Reco, they are kind of recoing Drew. Yeah, they, what, that's a good explanation yeah. for it. Drew, this team heads to Paris soon, but say. first they're giving you a little workout today. Right. I was going to say, I'd rather be tongue-tied than thrown to the mat by yeah, these guys, too. which I have been this morning. <laughs> but hey, Brendan, Ashley, real quick, before we get into this wrestling business again, can I tell you about something that's happening next week, which I'm also excited about? What's that? Uh, you may remember last year, at the end of last year, right before Thanksgiving, right before Christmas, we went into viewers' kitchens, and they shared with us some of their best Thanksgiving feast recipes and their best holiday treat recipes. Well, we're going to do it again next week. This time, we're going in the backyard. So we're looking for our viewers to submit their best backyard barbecue recipes. They need to do this through my Facebook page. If you go there now, you'll see that post right there. Add to the post with a picture of your best recipe and tell us a little bit about it. Next week, we're entering viewers' backyards, Brenda and Ashley, to share the best backyard BBQ recipes in our area. Okay, that's the message for next week. Let's talk about today. Matt, the law, Linland, don't be mad at me for taking some time out of your segment just now. No problem. <laughs> uh, Matt is a, a local product. Uh, graduated from Gladstone High School. Won a Olympic silver medal in 2000. Uh, fought UFC for a number of years. And he's now the head coach of USA Wrestling's Greco-Roman World Team. These young men behind us, Matt, are gonna take on the best in the world this August, but you're preparing for that this week in Portland, explain what you're doing with the gang this week. Well, I mean, we're just uh, we're doing base conditioning. So we're laying down the foundation for the end of the summer. So we're building these guys up, a lot of strength and conditioning right now, a little bit of mat work. We're doing a seminar, a lot of team building. We uh, paddled the Willamette on SUPS. Today we're doing some whitewater rafting. We're firing rifles out in Eagle <laughs> Creek. I mean, all kinds of good it's stuff. It's a team building experience for your guys. And again, today you said you're going to do, uh, do some rafting on the Clackamas. Upper Clack. Very cool, but how about wrestling? Because on Saturday, another great opportunity for young wrestlers in our area. You're gonna hold a clinic, a seminar, starting at nine in the morning, right here at Team Quest in Southeast Portland. Tell me about this experience. How hands-on will your guys be with the youth that come in? Well, since I get to coach them all the time, I'm gonna let them have the opportunity to serve the community and the athletes here locally. And they're gonna teach, each guy's gonna teach his own uh, session, you know? Okay. So they're gonna have opportunity to get on the mat, work with the actual guys that are gonna wrestle in the World Championships this summer. Summer. You can go to the Team Quest website right now to sign up. That's Team Quest, Q-U-E-S-T. Uh, how about a lesson right now? The difference between freestyle wrestling and the Greco-Roman that your guys are, are using this morning because both are Olympic sports. Okay, I'll have Pat and Ellis show you what freestyle looks like. Can you show us what that looks like, guys? So this would be a takedown in freestyle. Freestyle, then, pretty common to like high school, college yeah, style wrestling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really similar. You'll see similar stuff in high school and college. But in Greco-Roman, you can see some exciting action like this. Oh, man. See, they step it up a notch for the Greco-Roman. Yeah, Greco-Roman means art. step it up. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a different art form. You know, they're both great sports. And we love, we love our freestyle brothers, but uh, we feel our, our sports a little more exciting. You still feel like you could take someone down? Man, uh, yeah, I can still do it. I'm uh, 47 today, but I can still do it. Happy birthday to Matt the <laughs> Law Lindlin. Happy 47th birthday. Here's your present. Take me down, big guy. Take me down. <laughs> <laughs> he's 47, but he's still got it. We get the point. Get off me, birthday boy. Rod, Ashley, Brenda, back to you. Back being the key word this morning. Don't show my front, Steve. Oh, I know. Your back is Focus on my back. Are you doing okay real quick? You okay? I'm doing so great, Brendan. I'm doing great. Hey, hey, I'm 43 and, and feeling young today. Are you? Happy birthday. Yeah, oh my gosh. I see. It's not gonna end I feel well. like that was a Hollywood stunt. Cause it looked like he picked him up and then it was like all of a sudden yes, slow he motion. Did. He was a good sport. Yeah. Laying you do it? baby let's, Drew down let's have softly. You try it. Baby Drew. No, it's my job to criticize. I, I noticed that too. I wasn't gonna say it though. <laughs>